Hey guys, it's Anya, otherwise known as Pink Sweets here on YouTube, and today I'm going to be doing the colorful makeup tag, which I was tagged in by my amazing friend Anya, the other Anya. I will link her channel in a card above. This is my stylist. I don't know why I'm holding it. Um, but uh, she tagged me in this tag that she came up with the questions on her own, and yeah, so I'm going to be doing the questions. I have them right here. And just so you guys know, I did film this look that I'm wearing right now. It is with the James Charles and Morphe palette. And um, we are getting ready for our trip. So I did my makeup. I did the video for you. You guys will see that video before you see this one. So I'll link it in a card up above, um, as well as I will link Anya's channel up above and in the description box down below. And anybody that I talk about in this video, I will also link them down below in the description box. And I'm still wearing my Eeyore pajama top because... I didn't want to put on my sweater for Thanksgiving before I finish my makeup because I get powder all over everything. So, anyhow. Alright, so this is the colorful makeup tag. And thank you, Anya, so much for tagging me. I love you. I love your channel. And I'm so happy to have you as a friend here on YouTube. I think you're so talented. And I love the fact that you love to wear color. I just, I love that. Um, so, I actually seek out people that love to wear colorful eyeshadow. Um, so when and where did you start wearing color or using color? I cannot remember a time that I didn't. Um, ever since I started wearing makeup, um, which was when I was like 18 or 19, I have always worn colorful makeup. I've never been interested in neutral looks. I have done neutral looks for my channel, um, and I have grown to love some neutral looks that I've done. But on me personally, I feel confident, I feel pretty, and I just feel, it just feels right to wear colorful eyeshadow. I don't, I don't know why, um, I've always been attracted to color, I've always been attracted to rainbows and every color of the rainbow. You can throw together an eyeshadow palette, tell me I own every shade in the palette already, and I will still need that palette because you put them together. I don't know why, but that's just me. Um, what is your favorite color to wear? So on my eyes, my favorite color to wear is definitely either green or blue. I love or together. I love greens and blues. I know that for my eye color, purples, burgundies, those kinds of shades bring out green eyes. But for me, I just always feel confident and pretty when I wear greens and blues. So they're my favorites. Um, what is your go-to color combination? Greens and blues. Um, who are your favorite influencers to follow that inspire you color-wise? So on Instagram, it would definitely be uh, Mama, Mama Mitchell. I absolutely, positively love him. I also love Makeup by Raquel. Stunning, gorgeous, so talented. Um, and on YouTube, I would definitely say that Anya is one of them, the other Anya. Um, I love when she does like the pink and blue looks together or pink, purple, and blue, like I just, she comes up with great color combinations, and she always, the way she applies it, I just, I don't know, there's just something about it, I just love it, I love how she layers the colors, and adds glitter, and all that stuff, so, um, I would say Luscious Massacre, uh, Rich Lux's best friend, who is a drag queen, and I absolutely love his makeup every time he does it, I'm in awe of how, just the way he does it and his glitter lips like I can't stop staring at them in videos it just I love it um Sydney Nicole she is so talented um she did she's the one that I linked a couple times because she did the uh Spooktember in September and then she did um costumey looks in October and she is stunning she's amazing at doing cut creases she's amazing at drawing things on her eyelids like pictures and just everything she's amazing lethal kitten she is awesome every single one of her eye looks i fall in love with i don't i don't know how she does it um but i just can't stop watching so um and then butte beam i absolutely love her looks she does some more grungier looks as well um, and I just think they're always stunning as well. So those are definitely my favorite people to watch when I'm looking for inspiration and looking for color combinations and stuff like that. And I will link all of their channels down below. And I definitely suggest you go check them out because they're all amazing. I love all of their personalities as well. 
Um, what do your family and friends think about your colorful makeup style? <clears throat> so, my friends love it. Um, they compliment me. They think that um, they like the color combinations. They like that I wear bright eyeshadow. Um, they always say stuff like, oh, I wish I could wear that, which I think is kind of sad because I think that anyone can wear any color combination that they want to. Um, I mean, some of my friends do colorful makeup, but, you know, a lot of them stick to the more neutral looks and, and they say that it's because they, you know, but it, it just matters, I think, to what you're comfortable with, what you feel confident wearing and what makes you feel beautiful. Because if you don't feel beautiful wearing it, then don't wear it, you know what I mean? Like for me, when I wear browns and like a champagne, you know, shimmer on the eyelid, like I just don't feel like myself. So I think it's whatever makes you feel beautiful. Um, my parents, however, <laughs> took a little bit longer to come around and my extended family, like my aunts, my uncles and stuff like that. They have never really understood it, um, or at least they didn't in the beginning. Now they understand that it's my way of expressing myself artistically and they've become very, very supportive. Um, so that is what they think. Um, and then is there a color that you, uh, that you're looking for? A perfect formulation for no I honestly every color that I could ever want to put on my eyes I have found at least one that I absolutely positively love so I am I'm no longer looking for the perfect formula of anything I was looking for the perfect like acid like neon green but I found that in the um, pinky rose cosmetics bright lights palette so, um, would you rather wear a neutral lip color with colorful eyeshadow or the other way around a bold lip color with neutral eyeshadow for the rest of your life? I don't feel like I should have to choose. <laughs> I would like to wear colorful eyeshadow with colorful lips for the rest of my life, but if I had to choose, then I would definitely obviously choose a colorful eyeshadow with a neutral lip for the rest of my life. Um, and then there are two more questions. What is your opinion on glitter? Love it, hate it, or, uh, and why? I love glitter. Um, I don't love loose glitter as much. I don't feel like it works as well for me. I love glitter eyeshadows like, like for instance, this loose glitter from NYX. I have seen people use this on their eyes and for them it works great. For me, it just doesn't work as well. I prefer to use like a liquid eyeshadow, like the Steel and Magnificent Metals, the Milani Hypnotic Lights, you know, something liquidy, and then maybe put some loose glitter on top. Um, I just don't think the loose glitter for me stands out enough, I guess, I don't know. But I just, I love loose eyeshadow glitter type of stuff. Um, not loose, liquid. <laughs> Um, but I definitely, I love glitter and I love the, um, Urban Decay glitter liners, these, the heavy metal glitter liners, which I just ordered some from, um, Al, uh, Alex Express or Ali Express, something like that. And I cannot wait to play with them. That's the glitter liner in the shade Amp. Um, but I can't wait to play with them because they came in every shade and they were like a dollar a piece. So you'll see that in an upcoming video. Um, so yes, glitter, yes, all the way. Um, and what is your go-to colorful eyeshadow palette at the moment? So <clears throat> I would have to say if I'm going to do like a rainbow look, my go-to colorful eyeshadow would actually not be in a palette. It would be in single eyeshadows, which would be the Sugar Pill, um, single eyeshadows. I love them. I have them in almost every shade, and I just think that they're stunning. I think the formula is stunning, the matte ones are stunning, the shimmery ones are stunning, and they're just so colorful and bold, and I love them. Um, but the James Charles palette, um, I can see myself using that a lot. I already love it. I love the look I created with it today. And, um, that is probably going to become my go-to <laughs> colorful eyeshadow palette. I also like the Urban Decay Electric palette. That one doesn't have every shade, but I, I've always loved that one as well. And that one also has pressed pigments just like the James Charles one. So 
that's a few answers, but um, I am tagging, who am I tagging? I'm tagging Allison Krauss. I am tagging Valerie from Gimme Lip and More, and I am tagging Ann Morrison. I would like to see all three of them answer these questions because all three of them also love to work with colorful eyeshadow and I can't wait to see their answers. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Definitely go check out Anya's channel and her answers. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys. Love you.